What's good? It's your boy Randy Too Good back with another episode of the Pilot Show. It looks good, people. See, man, y'all gonna y'all won't be listening to me, fam. Y'all won't be listening to me, and I'll be telling y'all, y'all gotta stop doing that stuff, man. Drake, stop it, bro. Die. Here we go. So, the le- the living legend, Uncle Luke, Mister, ah, you so horny. Yo, he said, he said, yo, he ain't like it. He said, he, you know, he's a Florida native. Shout out to him, Two Live Crew, and all that stuff. Me so horny and all that stuff. Pause. But um, yeah, um, so he got on the internet. He said that, yo, man, he didn't like the way Drake was like supporting and like liking. Things with violence in it towards uh, Rick Ross. Now, see, this is and see, this is what people don't understand. Like, yo, I don't know their relationship, Uncle Luke and uh, Rick Ross, but understand this, bro. When people's like areas and like regions get involved, people will click up. They click up on you, bro. <laughs> like, yo, that's just how it is. When, when you when you openly disrespect somebody's city or your state or one of their peoples. They click up against you, cause I promise you, yo, Drake, like, yo, we gotta put my, we gotta put Florida on the list, brother. We got Cali on the list, we got Atlanta on the list, we gotta mark Florida on the list too, bro. Like, dang. See, I don't, I don't know, I don't know if it's gonna be too safe out there for you, brother. But like, yo, he was speaking facts, like, he was like, yo, man, he understand that, yo, some things happen when you go out places, but. When you embrace it, when you kind of like champion it and stuff, because I promise you, Drake, he shouldn't have said nothing. He should have just let it go. He should have just let it happen and just not really respond because you could have had possible deniability. Like, oh shit, man, I don't know what happened. I, don't, I ain't send them people. Like, yo, so he was like, yo, that was y'all. But we see the little tip, we see the little breadcrumbs of this thing. It may have because they saying, like, homie, they saying homie is. He connected to like Snoop in some way. He connected to like a Hell's Angels out there. We know that Drake is. I think he's like neighbors with uh, a, a Hell's Angels leader out there in Canada. So here we go, bro. Like yo, we we see we starting to see the breadcrumbs, bro. We starting to see the connection to maybe somebody close to you. So or maybe you hypothetically had put this out. You put a head you put a head out on, bro. That's what you did, bro. Damn, scandalous! <laughs> I'm playing. Like I don't think it. Is. I think it's just niggas. Nigga, see, I, we gotta come up with a new term because I promise you, niggas just be professional friends. Like, do I think Drake called this nigga and said, "Yo, go out there and do that"? No, I think he's very loosely probably connected to Drake. He probably know Drake. For, his homeboy probably killed with Drake. And then he probably did something just off the of strength of that of, like, maybe I could be, get some, bro. See, niggas just be professional friends, bro. Like, yo, niggas are just professional friends. They want to just upgrade their resume. That's why I say, like, Maul. Maul is a professional friend. Like, because my thing is this. Yo, like, it's just, like, yo, y'all, it don't even, it's not even that serious, bro. Like, that's what the thing with him and act. Like, yo, I don't think it's that serious to where you just got to keep on beating a dead horse. Like, yo, like, just off topic real quick. Yo, Maul got mad at the BT Awards because they used the phrase, oh, pop out. Like, yo, he over, like, yo, come on, fam. Like, at, at some point, we just going to have to just, uh, like, Get over it. Like, yo, come on, man. The song was hot. Your man's lost. And it's like, yo, it's it's victory time. But I digress, man. That's But I digress. Let's move on. Yeah, but see, man, Drake, I don't know, man. Maybe maybe you just can't be going. You can't be going to Florida for no time soon, man. It may be a little warm out there for you, man. It may get dark out there for the light-skinned brother. But, um... Yeah, man, this is crazy. Like, I, I want to see where this going to go because I'm, I'm telling you, bro, just let, don't, it should be no shenanigans when Future and them go up there. If you, if, if there's shenanigans, if Future goes up there and then him and Metro goes up there and there's shenanigans out there, you really going to have, you going to have a bad time because now we, we got Cali on the list of questionable areas. We got Florida on the list of questionable areas. Now, 
We got to like, oh, hold on. Like, yo, is Atlanta, Atlanta is T, it's like, it's like this. It's a, with uh, t Rail Sabres, it's a wobbler. Like, we got to understand, like, damn, hold on, man. Wait a minute. This is kind of crazy, yo. I don't know, but I mean, I say Atlanta is a, 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 Atlanta is a wobbler because like, yo, he still got peoples out there like 21 and his people. So uh, he could go there too. Like, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's, a, it's some Atlanta people out there that rock with him, but it is a, like, I still think a uh, little baby probably rock with him. So it's a, but if there is shenanigans out there, when future and them go out there, trust me, it's definitely, it's going to be off limits for you, bro. It's, it's going to be crazy. Yeah. So I don't know, man. Yo, like, comment, subscribe. We almost had 200. Please, like, yo, give me the 200, bro. Like, let's go. So, yeah, man. Comment down below. Tell me what y'all think about what's going on, man. Peace.